Yeah, good everyone. So in this course, we will be creating a Flutter, Flutter uh, social media app with Flutter, social media, media app with Flutter, and uh, Node.js, we'll be using Express, Express to start. So for us to start, you can just come put a uh, I'll create a folder in my, in my desktop environment it is my desktop environment so I'll create a folder call it uh, social media app or oh, let me say project open this folder come to this place type cmd if you are in windows type cmd so we'll start from here but before we start we'll make sure that uh, you have node.js installed in your system so we'll check if we have node.js installed in our system oh, sorry node-v okay we have node.js version 20 installed in our system so we are good to go but in case you don't have node.js installed in your system you can uh, you can quickly come here you can quickly come here and uh, search for node.js search for node.js not okay just node.js come here you can download node.js from here okay download our, i have it already so i don't need to download it so we'll go back to our project and uh, what we can do next is uh, create uh, a new project so here we'll just uh, make a directory md directory social media backend so we can just uh, cd into this directory cd into the directory and we'll start with 10 pm in it and as why okay so this will take it this will take a while to run all right visualization is uh, ready so we can just come here and uh, okay we're already in this uh, backend folder so we're already in our backend folder so we can just go to our uh, code editor and see what we've got there all right we have our package.json here already so what we can do is to install other packages we need like express so we'll say npm install or you can use i okay, let me just clear the screen so you can see very well sorry i need to increase okay so you can say npm install you can use i as well express we need mongos db that's what we'll be using mongos we use JSON web token web token since we'll be use, since we are creating API we use bcrypt b crypt is my bcrypt correct bcrypt js okay and we we'll use uh, env env in this okay let me just cross check b crypts js and so on okay so let's wait for it to install once it has installed uh compose all right installation is done we'll come here you see we have our node uh, node module uh, uh, already okay so we have our package bcrypt 
this and so on and so forth so what we can do next is to create our folder structure for the back end so the first folder is going to be the config folder we'll keep our, our database so we can just say db.js then the next folder is uh, make sure you make sure you're in the root directory the next folder is uh, controllers and next folder is uh, models and next folder will be rats because we use rats and we'll create our dot env very important and i'll create a server okay so we are set we're set to go so i'll end the video here and we'll Please subscribe to my channel by clicking on the notification bell icon. Thank you.